retro reviews we're gonna go ahead and uh, look at another ad games product we do have quite a few ad games product maybe right, yes. we pick them up at uh, we get good prices on eBay right good deals and stuff like that flea markets and those thrift shops and stuff like that well this one is called the Sega Genesis uh, brought to you by ad games of course and Sega the Sega Genesis arcade master it's an arcade stick you got it mm -hmm. it's an arcade stick it has 26 built-in games in it actual built-in games Sega Genesis games a lot of these don't have all Sega Genesis games again it's by uh, released by ad games and licensed from uh, Sega so uh, with all the different games in the back so this is the box real quick so we're gonna go ahead and give it a closer look All right, guys, so we're going to give a closer look real quick, and then we're going to connect it to our television. Again, it's by Ad Games and Sega Genesis, licensed by Sega, of course. A lot of people have so much animosity towards Ad Games, but at the same token, doesn't Sega Genesis, you know, carry the brunt of this by licensing it out and just, you know, just to make money off of it, so, uh, without, you know, looking at the quality of what it is, so. You would think that Sega Genesis will be able to fix the main issue of this we'll talk about in a few minutes. We've been talking about it for a while. Anyway, this includes 26 actual Sega Genesis titles, which is pretty, pretty cool. On top of it here, it's, uh, it's uh, advertising Virtual Fighter 2, Sonic Spinball, Shinobi 3, one of my favorites, of course, and more. Picture of Virtual Fighter 2 on the front. It uses the SD card uh, uh, things, for, so we have quite a few of these right here with the games in it. And... Uh, here goes the titles in the back. You got Alex Kidd, Alien Storm, Ultra Beast, you got me, babe? Arrow, mm -hmm. Arrow Flash, Chicon, Comic Zone, Columns, Columns 2, uh, no, Columns 3, I'm sorry. Crackdown, Eternal Champions, Flicky, Game Ground, Golden Axe, Golden Axe 3, no, no Golden Axe 2, huh? Jewel Master, Kid Chameleon, Streets of Rage 1, 2, uh, no 3, Shinobi 3, Shadow Dancer, uh, Shinobi 2, Shadow Dancer, Sonic Spinball, Sonic 3, Blast, The Ooze, Victor Man, Victor Man 2, and Virtual Fighter 2, it looks like that's what it was advertising right here, right? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna open up this up real quick. Open it up, see what this comes with. 26 games. Pull it out. This is what you get when you open it. Okay. Comes with the adapter, right? Mm -hmm. Maybe this adapter works with the other. The adapter comes with the manual, right? Then we're gonna go ahead and open up the arcade stick of stuff. We do I do have a condom bring it up at the end of this, of course. But nice little design there. What do you think, babe? Mm -hmm. Nice design. You got the Virtual Fighter guys right there. So they were actually, Virtual Fighter is what they were publishing on this right here, uh, advertising, of course. Has the slot, so you can go ahead and put in the uh, SD card. Let's see. Let's put that in there. Okay, get in there, brother. Get in there. Okay. Clicks in, of course. Um, bottom has. This is the way the bottom looks right now. It has those rubber pieces so it doesn't slide off your table when you're playing it, of course. It is comfortable on your lap. I've done that. You got me, babe? Yes. You got the three, uh, the six different buttons, A, B, C, X, Y, Z. You have, uh, it looks like the start button, the reset button, and the power button over here. You hear it? The clicking. The clicking on the actual joystick itself. And it has the wire in the back right here so you can connect it. This is the wire to connect the power. So we're gonna go ahead and connect this to our TV and show you what it looks like. So, mm -hmm. all right. So we're gonna go ahead. I, as you can see, I connected it to our television. A uh, the AV wires, no stereo, babe. Of course, right? Mono. No stereo, mono, of course. Uh, so we connected that, plugged it in, and we're gonna see what it looks like. Again, this is the Arcade Master, Sega Genesis Arcade Master power button right there. All right, and as you can see. All the basic games that come with the different different um, ad games, Sega Genesis products, the Alex Kid, of course, right? All these things. So it's pretty nice. But to me, the, the what's really worth here, babe, is the SD. Am I right? Mm -hmm. So let's throw the SD and see what happens. All right. It's recording. It's searching for the games. Sometimes it takes a little while for it to come up. There it is. Read the card. All the different games. All the different. As you can see, we have the whole library of Genesis on this. Very, very nice. Different titles. They're all here. Batman, Batman Returns. Uh, all these different titles. Bubsies, Castlevania, uh, Rondo Blood, Contra Hardcore. Uh, I know I always go to. I always go to. Uh, Streets of Rage because Streets of Rage is just the 
the soundtrack is just so freaking cool. But we have all the different games here, they all work. Loading it. I'm gonna see. This sound should be on it pretty good, right? Mm hmm. Should be up. Looks nice though, right? Yes, it does. The difference with this right here is we're playing, we're actually playing with an arcade stick instead of using a controller in our hands. The arcade stick. Oh! Our main complaint, right, babe? Mm hmm. Our main complaint is what? The sound. sound. What is the problem? <laughs> oh. Okay, let's start again. Ah. Ooh. You hear that? Oh. 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 That, that sound. That is terrible. Yeah, I, I, I would say it's just that the sound, right? Man? It's horrible. Anyway. Set it. Go back to the menu, of course. Every time you go back to the menu, it brings you back to these different games that you have here. So the games here are pretty nice, but to me, the biggest part about this is with the SD card. Now, uh, of course, we mentioned what one of the bad issues of this, of course, is the sound. It's always the sound with the Ad Games products. I don't know why. Again, I've said it before. I believe that Genesis and Sega themselves have to have some kind of the brunt of the blame on this because they licensed this out and could care. It doesn't seem like they really cared that their product was not give you know was not delivered you know at the true sense of what it should be and what we us us fans believe in so but the, the SD card is what kicks butt on this let me shut it off real quick um it's really nice but the big problem that I have with this and I don't know if, remember if you remember me saying this babe is there is no port to connect another controller yeah so all the games that you just saw right there a lot of them are two players there's no way of enjoying them with a buddy. So that hurts this tremendously. If this had a, a, a port that you connect a controller to it, this would be awesome. It would definitely be a lot higher. I wouldn't say awesome, but it would definitely be a lot higher rating. So because of that, I'm going to give this a six, baby. Yeah. I'm going to give it a six. So. That's our feelings. That's the Sega Genesis Arcade Master by Ad Games, of course. The sound is the issue, as always, with the Ad Games products. I don't know why. And the other part about it is the fact that it doesn't have a port to connect another controller, but you can connect an SD card with the uh, um, arcade, uh, the Genesis Classics. But always remember, I think I've mentioned it before, right, babe, that you need to have a uh, an SD card that only goes eight gigabytes, babe. Eight, eight, eight gigs eight or gigs. four gigs. Yes, yeah, yeah. Nothing over eight. If the, for some reason, these things will not uh, recognize them. So, uh, no, I don't think that's correct on this. No, 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 no. No, um, we're wrong, babe. We're wrong. The Genesis ones can use bigger ones. Oh. Th these are these are sixteen. Yeah. It's the Atari Flashback mm. that's from um, for some reason doesn't go over eight. It doesn't. I don't understand the Atari Flashback portable. So. Uh, sorry for that misconception guys. Anyway, that's our feelings. That's the Sega Genesis Arcade Master Arcade Stick. Again, by at Games. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, can you see me babe? Yes. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys soon. And as always, keep, keep it, it retro. retro.